This is the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce. Rite Aid reported a fiscal second quarter EPS loss of 11 cents this morning, which was above consensus estimates of 18 cents per share. Revenues for the quarter rose 1.8 percent year over year to $6.3 billion, just above analyst estimates for $6.22 billion. Rite Aid has lowered its expectations for fiscal year 2012 for a loss in earnings per share of range between 40 to 56 cents per share compared to its previous forecast of 42 to 64 cents per share. Analysts expect a loss of 50 cents per share. John Stanley, Rite Aid's president and CEO, said, quote, We are pleased with the continued improvement in our top-line results, highlighted by three consecutive quarters of same-store sales growth. Customers are responding positively to our sales initiatives, including our highly popular and fast-growing Wellness Plus loyalty program, which now has over 44 million enrolled members. Our positive same-store sales growth, along with continued reductions in operating costs, drove an increase in adjusted EBITDA. Rite Aid has a potential upside of 27.1% based on a current price of $1.07 and an average consensus analyst price target of $1.36. For more updates, stay tuned. You're watching the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce.